Today I'm going to answer the question, how can I rank my real estate website at the top of Google? Hi, my name is Dan Roshan. I've been selling real estate for more than a decade. My team and I, we have sold thousands of homes. And this is how we do it. I was working last week with one of our new marketing assistants here on our real estate sales team. And what she was doing that day was she was uh, developing a lot of web pages for our, our real estate website. And we were strategizing and I was sharing with her how to rank those web pages, you know, to be able to be found on, on Google because, you know, there's billions of, of pages. I don't know how many, you know, pages are, but I'm going to, you know, there's, there's a lot of pages on, on, on Google and on the, on the web. And it's really easy to not be found. So here's how you can be found. So when you think about this, you want to think hyper local. You want to utilize a strategy that's called a long tail keyword search. And so what that means that is instead of being like really ge generic or really general and using like a broad term such as like real estate sales agent in Virginia, uh, that's, you know, there's going to be a lot of people maybe searching that, but it's not going to get, you're not going to get found uh, if you if you choose to, to use a term like that. Instead, what you want to do is you want to, you want to be really hyper local, very, very specific. And the more specific, the better. So if you take it like general, like real estate agent, and then you get more specific in Alexandria and more specific in Alexandria Kingstown, or an even more, more specific two bedroom, two bathroom condominium with a deck. And if that's the way that you want to think uh, in, in terms of this. So, uh, so instead of, again, instead of real estate in Virginia, you want to be able to promote, uh, Two bedroom, two bathroom condominium in Kingstown, Alexandria, Virginia with a deck. That's going to be really specific. You're not going to get as many people that are going to be searching that term, yet when they search it, you're going to be found at the top of Google. So it's going to take a little bit of work to be able, you're going to, because you're going to have to create a lot of pages and do this through time to be able to be found. The great news is, is that when somebody does search for that, they're going to be a prime, prime candidate. I mean, two things is one, they're going to find you. Two is that's going to be a prime uh, buyer candidate, or or maybe even a seller candidate, depending on what you're what you're promoting. That's going to be very, very interested in doing something. Because if you think about it, if you're that specific in your keyword search, and when you're when you're getting on your phone or your computer, or whatever, and you're typing in, "Hey, I'm looking for a home for sale," or "I'm looking for a home, two bedroom, two bath condominium, Kingstown, Virginia, Alexander, Virginia." you're going to be a pretty much a motivated buyer at that point or pretty specific in regards to what you're looking for. So that's what you want to, um, you know, what you want to appeal to. I hope that that's useful and I know that you're going to get found on Google to your success.